My name is Amy Francis, and I teach computer apps and computer science at Chinook Middle School. And I'm going to show you how to access PowerSchool. If you are on a computer or tablet, I suggest starting with the Kennewick School District website. So open your favorite internet browser, like Chrome or Edge or Firefox, and navigate to ksd.org. On the right side of the screen, hover over the word parents and then click the link for your power school. This will take you to the sign-in screen. Another way to access power school is using an app on your phone. Apple Store and the Google Play Store both feature power school app. Search in the store for power school, download it to your phone, and when it's ready you can click to open it. If it asks for our district code, it is F R H H, and you can sign into the app using your PowerSchool username and password. If it is your first time signing into PowerSchool, there are a few extra steps to take. From the PowerSchool screen, you will look for the option to create a parent account. Then you will follow the prompts to create this account. Sometimes there will be quite a few places where you need to choose create an account. You will complete the required fields, like your name, and your email, and your password. And then you will create your PowerSchool ID so you can sign into it in the future. For your student, you will need their access code to add them to your PowerSchool dashboard. You should have that from your school, or you can ask your child's teacher. And that will let you get into PowerSchool. Once you're signed into PowerSchool, you will see the dashboard screen. This has a list of all your students' grades. It has a student at the top, and on the right, it has upcoming assignments and recent assignments. At the top, at this course selector button, you can click to change to another class. You can get more detail for one particular class, or if you have another child, you can click to change it to that other child or children. You'll have a list of options for the classes you can select, and clicking on a particular class will give you more detail. So those are the basics on how to access PowerSchool and get signed up for the first time. Thanks for watching.